am back with another Pennywise haul and if you like to see the stuff I picked up from my beauty supply store please keep on watching so I went to Pennywise because I was really looking for a conditioner for my hair and um, I usually like to go there not at month end because I notice when you go any store around month end time it's like crazy you always have you know packed you don't get to see and you know you just always in a rush grab what you need and head out but um so i like to go before month end or just during the week like at random like wednesday tuesday wednesday so that it's usually rather calm on those days however i told myself no makeup you're gonna i took made a list of things i had um of things i wanted to get and i cannot stick to that of course venture out into a couple other things but i picked up no makeup it was like you know when you play monopoly and you get go directly to jail if you pass go do not collect 200 or do not pass go or something like that it was like Rana, go straight get what stuff on your list do not look at the makeup go directly to things and do not collect any makeup I actually even put a comment like that on my Facebook page. It's you need to check out my Facebook page. I will put the link here for you guys to check out my Facebook page. You need to check it out. I have a giveaway coming on there soon. So what did I get? I picked up more fresh and soft, white, dry and sensitive and normal and combination. I picked up one each because I like them and they to me work both the same and I actually picked, paid $6.95 for these. So the price is really fluctuating everywhere I guess whenever they get a new bag. The other item that I picked up are actually two body butters that I saw when I actually walked into the Pennywise. I went to Grand Bazaar just for those of you who want to know a location. I went to that particular branch and these body butters are from Beauty Formula. I'm not familiar with the brand. If you are, let me know. I'm sure these might be beauty supply stores kind of brand. And um, it's vanilla sugar and vitamin E body butter. So this is what it looks like. And these were $16.95. And if you want like US equivalent, this is like two seventy five US to sixty five US dollars. And they also have a cherry blossom and vitamin E. And actually, this one was they had a, a I won't say a test that it was one that was open in the store because it does come sealed. So if you're gonna purchase, make sure yours is sealed. And I smell this one and just smell this one in store, and it smells really nice, very light, which is something I like for work. And then they had this other one, and I didn't get the smallest one because it was sealed. So I just picked it up because, of course, it's vanilla sugar. It's supposed to smell good. And, oh my gosh, it smells really like a light vanilla sugar. It's not heavy, but I like it, and it seems pretty moisturizing. And for the price, I think it's really good for you. So I'm definitely going to be using that. What I really went for was to pick up this L'Oreal um, Advanced Hair Care. Total Repair 5 Damage Erasing Balm. I saw this. I think it was in my friend Jahara. She was talking about this. If it wasn't her, it was somebody else whose video I watched. It was an MT's video and they were talking about how awesome this product is. So I had to go and buy it. I paid $49.95. I really want something for my hair. I use the Aussie 3 Minutes. But my hair and my skin has a way it does not like monotony. And I think that's a lot of like my personality. I don't like things always one way. And um, my hair does like that. So if I use something over and over, it just doesn't. I think a lot of people maybe can say that they just don't try to go too much into a routine over and over because it becomes too redundant. So I want another hair mask to switch around with my True Minute because I generally use my True Minute Miracle just as a regular conditioner so I actually picked up a couple of um, the what do you call it suave professionals the one for tin hair I picked up a couple because on Christmas I got it on sale for one US dollar in Walmart so I picked up a, quite a few and so I really more or less need conditioners so I thought this would be awesome I'm not sure whose video I saw but they mentioned this that they got this from the Dollar Tree and it was really amazing um, it's a herbal essence clarifying conditioner is in kiwi lime i don't know if it comes in any other like um scent but she said this is an amazing clarifying shampoo a lot it's comparable to a lot of more expensive ones i paid 10.95 tt dollars but if you have a dollar tree you can definitely check it out it has a pretty pleasant scent it's nothing very like icky smelling so got that also and i think i'm gonna just like use that as a regular clarifying conditioner because i do put oils in my hair and i really sometimes feel like it weighs down my hair from time to time so 
I really want to get a clarifying shampoo and just a little eek I went asking for is there any other clarifying shampoos and the uh, girl who was there she was like what's that I don't know you want to look and see if you see anything yourself not gonna run other item I picked up again another conditioner item um, is this one and only Brazilian tech deep penetrating conditioning treatment and when I was asking about um, deep conditioner along with the, uh, this I saw a packet of the one and only and then that one was like 995 which is like 150 US and I was asking the girl do you have anything larger than that because even when I try out stuff with my hair I don't know if well as if it's gonna work well with just one use it might take two or three uses so I don't really want a one application kind of thing so she told me they had this which is $19.95 TT dollars just double the amount and um this is like what three US dollars but I will get a lot more use it's a deep penetrating treatment formula with natural carotene vitamins and proteins to help improve the strength of hair and so you just like will shampoo your hair and then leave this in for two to three minutes and then you rinse so really excited to try out this so I have like three different um, conditioners here for you guys I also was there with the boys and they picked up this and I thought this was a really good deal this is um the axe this one is in music which is what got Joshua's attention and um, it was $22.95 and this alone in itself is twenty, like twenty two ninety five or twenty four ninety five. You get a little mini one here, which you can of course take use in school. However, he said this little one here, which says excite, it actually smells like like some like it's female. So who knows? I might get a little something in it too. I was like uber excited for these, and I've never really seen these. These are the Via Naturals. Usually, I hear everyone talk about these, but they got this in like other beauty supply stores ones that are not very close to me I was surprised if anyways actually had these and they had these for $6.95 each this is the avocado oil and um, avocado oil is actually the number one ingredient in this it says avocado then canola oil sunflower carrot oil so it's a mix it's not pure but it's the first ingredient and then the other one I got was the jojoba oil and jojoba oil was actually the first ingredient in this oil so I usually, you know how you check to see what ranking it goes so these are pretty 6.95 you can't go wrong super excited to try these because I've heard so much about the avocado oil and the jojoba oil I actually ordered the jojoba oil online already so I supposed to get I purchased it from Amazon I plan to I had really just plan to mix it with my coconut oil to use but um all of these are like hair oil it's not necessary for your skin so really anxious to try these and I will let you guys know and let me see how the avocado oil smells does it smell like avocado oh it actually smells like shampoo okay I don't know what that's supposed to mean right <laughs> this is the jojoba oil the jojoba oil is a lot more tamer than the avocado oil it smells really really good but that was pretty much it that I can pretty much show you. I got things like toothpaste and toothbrushes and, you know, other personal stuff that you usually get on a regular monthly basis. I just like to go pretty much during the, you know, not month end when it's crazy so I can look around. Um, I did forget a couple of things that I did not have on my list. So chances are there may be another um, Pennywise haul. We'll try to resist this makeup area except that one of my friends they need me to go and get um, some of that starry blushes so I'm trying to avoid but if I have to I will definitely let you guys know if I pick up any good find so until my next haul video take care bye